Good morning, everyone. Dr. Bruce Stetter, Chair of your ACBSP Board of Directors, coming to you again from Salt Lake City, Utah, where the mountains are now dusted with a covering of white. Thoughts of winter and the approaching ski season are in everyone's minds. For those of you here in the United States, November 26th is the annual Thanksgiving Day holiday, a day when Americans stop to remember the beginnings of their great country, to give thanks for the abundance in their lives, and to gather with friends, family, and loved ones. Whether or not you're living here in the U.S. or a U.S. citizen living somewhere else in the world, we should all take the opportunity to stop on the 26th and be thankful for all that we have in our lives. The past eight months have been among some of the most trying times that our world has ever seen, and certainly among the most trying faced by this generation. We've all suffered loss, challenges, or difficulties that make this past eight months hard. But we also have all witnessed great acts of kindness, a renewed commitment to faith in mankind's ability to survive and prosper, and we've witnessed hope. If there was ever a time in our history when we need to practice gratefulness and to spend time thinking about the things we have to be thankful for in our lives, it's now. So, I'd like to ask each one of you, no matter where you are, to take a little time and think about the things we have to be thought thankful for in our lives. I wish you well and thank you for everything you do every day to make this world a better place. And I hope that the days ahead are better. To those of you who observe the Thanksgiving Day holiday, happy Thanksgiving. And I hope you have an enjoyable day. I know that this Thanksgiving may not allow you to be together with family and friends like you would want to be, but I encourage you to pick up the phone, make a video call, set up a joint Zoom dinner, or whatever you need to do to reach out to those you care about and make a connection. I'll be back with more video updates and messages in the future, but in the meantime, as always, stay safe and stay healthy.